There's an NBA star that is being sued by literally everyone. Who is it? Probably the nicest guy in the NBA. It's raining lawsuits, and Steph Curry has absolutely zero umbrella. We know he doesn't have an umbrella because he's got like six kids too. A huge number of big stars in Hollywood and sports being sued over their connection to the Ponzi scheme known as FTX. You guys remember that? He was like, I don't need to know anything about crypto. <laughs> like, literally looking back, probably not a great advertising campaign. Remember they're a crypto exchange. They had these nerdy founders, and those nerdy founders stole literally billions of dollars from their clients. And then they lost it all in this, like, nerd term called arbitrage trading. Running point for the celebrities promoting this fraud. Steph Curry, but it gets worse. So the Golden State Golden Boy not only being sued for promoting crypto, but he's also being sued over the NFT Ponzi scheme known as the Bored Ape Yacht Club. I didn't even know that was a thing. Did you guys know? Google this. People argue that the Bored Ape Yacht Club was founded by racists. This is crazy. Intending to make gross racial stereotypes and passing them off as cool. Who could possibly make someone with the squeaky clean of an image of Steph get involved in NFTs and crypto? I don't know. Uh, bad advice, people. Also very, very, probably greed as well. Steph Curry's got enough money. He doesn't need to get involved with the, what's it called again? Bored Ape Yacht Club. <laughs> this is a great lesson. Sometimes not every bag you need to go and grab. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is rough. Don't get involved in shit you don't understand. And if you don't understand it, don't make commercials about not understanding it. Because I can promise you, I have about as much knowledge of crypto and non-fungible tokens as Steph Curry does. And I, I know less than nothing. I don't even know why a screenshot can't just double as an NFT. I have no idea. The difference between me and Steph Curry is I haven't lost any money on crypto. And I haven't lost anyone else money on crypto and I'm not being sued for losing other people's money on crypto in both suits they're trying to uh, determine the level of liability that is Steph Curry's but there's billions of dollars missing and the courts are they are foaming at the mouth to find people to blame in probably one of the biggest scams since since Madoff right and I am betting Steph Curry wishes he and the Golden State Warriors never got involved in FTX. The Warriors were involved, too. Remember, they were selling FTX bobble nights. They thought it was all easy money. Crypto.com Arena, FTX this, Bored Ape Yacht Club that. Listen, bad news for Steph. There are going to be people taking him to court, and they are not going to stop until they get some of his money that he got for who knows what, doing who knows what, a money, mo what do they say, money, and a fool and his money are soon parted. Yeah, that's what's about to happen.